Hi friends, welcome to Sketchware Tutorials and in this video I am going to show you how to make HTML editor app using Sketchware. So open the app Sketchware and start with the new project. I am going to name it as HTML editor. That's it. And here I am taking one edit text. This edit text is used to take the HTML code from the user. The user has to write the HTML code or CSS code or JavaScript code here. And let me modify the properties of this edit text. I think let me change the height to 500 dp. That's it. Let me increase the size to 20 dp and change the hint to enter your code that's it here and here I am taking one button and let me change the properties of this button that's it Here after finishing the HTML code the user has to press here and the corresponding web page loads in the next page. So I am going to add one more page here and I am going to name it as load that's it and here in this load.xml page I am taking one button and web view. sorry and let me change the properties of this button and this button is used to go back to the previous page that's it and this uh, the logic of the HTML code loads here in the web view component so now I think the layout section is almost complete yes the layout section is almost complete and let's move to the logic section now and here this is the logic of main activity dot java so this is the here as you can see there is only one button here so when button one is pressed you have to go to the page to and you have to load the corresponding HTML file there. So to save the file, I am using a file shared preferences and I am going to name the file name. I am going to name the file as data and I am using this file set data key component and I am setting the key as HTML that's it and value to be obviously edit text and the HTML code will be saved in the file and we have to move to the page 2 to load the page so I am adding an intent I and I am setting the screen to load activity and I have to start the activity and I am going to finish the present activity that's it and let's move to the load activity.java and here on activity create on activity create we have to load the HTML file so go to the component view go to web view load URL and here you have to do a, a, some modifications I am taking this join and and here you have to join data it is it data text slash HTML and put a comma there that's it 
and you have to add file shared preferences you have to name the same file name which is earlier we have to use I forgot the file name so where is the file name sorry the file name is data so I'm going to name the same file here so I'm taking the same data which is present in the same both pages and here here also I am taking one intent to move pages and on activity create you have to get the data the HTML file from previous page so I am taking this file get data key and I am making the key as HTML which is uh, present over there that's it and when button 1 is clicked you have to go back to the main page so simply intent set screen main activity and start the activity present the that's it and let's run the app now and let's see whether it is working or not with a simple HTML code here as you can see on opening the page I am seeing the presenter code I am pasting a simple HTML code over here I think as you can see I copied a simple HTML code from article on internet and as you can see this is a blue heading let's go back to my app now I think there is a bug main.xml I think so and let me change the height to match parent no no let me change the height to 300 dp and let me change the lines of code to 500 lines that's it and let me run the app now before you can't see the html code let's test now here as you can see previously uh, my html code is not visible now it is visible as you can see it's an article from internet and now i think there is a mistake uh, in the previous here i am naming my channel name that is sketchware tutorials that's it and let me change the color to red that's it and here I am going to press this finish my project here as you can see sketch by tutorials is visible that's it for today guys thank you for watching my videos please like and subscribe for more videos like this thank you